Tig or stick, which one are you? What's up guys, I'm Chase. I'm an instructor here at Western Welding Academy. And today we're gonna to be going over the pros and cons of Tig and stick. So first we're gonna talk about the pros of stick welding. It's much faster than all the other processes. It takes two seconds to grab a rod and put it in your stinger and you're able to add a lot more material to that pipe or plate or whatever it is you're welding. Second of all, you can stick weld anywhere, whether that's in a shop, outside, or wherever you might be. Compared to TIG, you need to be mainly inside. You can do it outside, but you have to have a windbreak or a hooch as we call it out in the field. And that's gonna be the same with MIG as well. Touching on that, it's not affected by wind. It's got a flux coated rod and that's gonna be your shielding gas right there. Compared to TIG, where you just have the argon or helium or whatever your shielding gas is for that, if it gets blown away by the wind, you're gonna get porosity and then you're gonna to have to grind it all out. One other thing with stick, it's a little bit easier to learn, harder to master compared to TIG. It's a little bit harder to learn, but way easier to master. And the last thing, there's gonna be less consumables compared to TIG and MIG. You just have a rod and you have a stinger. All right, moving on to TIG now. We're gonna give you guys some of the pros. First of all, it's a lot cleaner. You don't have any slag on the inside of that pipe compared to stick anymore. So you don't have to go flushing out the pipe to clean it all out. And it's pretty much weld it, get done with it, and then you can start running product through that pipe. As far as the cleaner part, you don't need a grinder to take off any slag. Once you burn that wire, and if it's burnt super, super clean and burnt right, you just can lay right another pass right on top of it. Also another thing with TIG is your roots are gonna be a lot more uniform. So you're able to make it look the same on the bottom of that pipe as the top of the pipe with TIG compared to stick. You're gonna to have to manipulate that rod a little bit more to try and get that root to be even all the way across. Lastly with TIG, one of the biggest pros is you don't have to worry about fumes. Fumes are one of the biggest hazards in the welding industry. As you get older and you keep breathing in them fumes for a long period of time, it's gonna take a real big toll on your body and it's gonna cause major respiratory issues. So we don't have to worry about having ventilation paired with stick. You have to have your ventilation to keep the fumes away from you. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Let us know in the comments whether you guys like TIG or stick better. If you're interested in learning any of these processes, go to applytoweld.com and put an application in. And we'll see you on the next one.